number one. He moved that semi-final against Korea against Lee Young. Yes, that was uh, a little bit surprising. They had played really tight matches. Uh, um, maybe she's uh, a little tired, but I can also see she's got a little strapping on her um, left knee, and um, I don't know if um, that was hampering her yesterday. And she just played really, really well. Cylinders, but we haven't seen it so far. I know it's only three points in, but I somehow expected her to make a really sharp start. Yeah. Um, I saw the match against them. Uh, after winning the Olympic gold, playing the Chinese national games in both team and individual, then moving on to Finland and uh, the World Team Championship, and now here in Denmark. seen that match, um, at least heard the result from yesterday, and um, there's no doubt that she would like to send her team off with a win here in the final. What a good rally. Oh, yeah. that's... Nice angle. Chen Fei starts to go for a little bit more control on the uh, clear drop play because she doesn't score a whole lot of easy points, especially not against uh, Chen Fei. The time that Chen Fei felt the pressure of uh, leading her country yes. in um, the uh, World Championship uh, team tournament. Lost at a uh, 10 nothing against the Chinese player. And it's also a situation where that strapping on the uh, back of the right leg might be a uh, trouble. But there's been a lot of um, Chinese support here in the yes. uh, Sarah's Arena. It's a good shot yeah. to sort of put enough pressure on Yamaguchi so she can't play with that uh, precision. Yesterday, Yamaguchi had uh, big problems finding the uh, backcourt. Nice angle. Ooh. Yeah, I thought that too steep. Yeah. Oh, that's a brilliant... <laughs> Nullify the pressure from uh, Yamaguchi. Good to put some variation into the game. Back of the court at the moment is Chen Fei. Yeah, I think she is reciprocating. Oh! Wait, you oh. Find... 
Marky normally does. I don't know if she plays really sharp, but I think she has to uh, uh, kick it up a notch on the uh, sharpness side when she gets the chance. So I think we'll see more winners or losers from her than uh, normally. There she went for Chen Fei wants that trophy real bad. Yeah. I think, um, uh, and um, I think she wants to make amends for that. Yeah. Good shot, good shot. Yeah. Front call. That was Anse Jung brilliant that yesterday. And uh, controlled all the rest. You just uh, find some extra energy you take against the Olympic champion and you go in and win the first game 2018. That's, that's mentally tough. Yeah. Oh, that's a oh, moment of magic from Yamaguchi, but not quite. Placed. Yeah. For that strapping on her right leg, whether it's hamstring or calf muscle or perhaps both. Oh, good shot. And again. Oh! oh. say last week, it's a couple of weeks ago now, the Sudan Cup, isn't it? She had it yesterday and I checked whether she had it in response to the five straight points from Chen Yu Fei. The second game quicker, more mistakes. So I don't think that's the way she's going. I think she's just uh, going into this uh, survival mode and uh, to play so well to uh, to catch up. Yeah. You know, and I think that Newton's third law of relativity is coming in here, that for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction. Yeah. And I think that after the high, there has to be a low. At some and point. At some point. You can't remain on a high the whole time. On top of all the entirety of, of this uh, period here. No, I don't think they can. So, sort of in hindsight, raises some questions about the surprised. Oh, Chinese type teammates, and it looks almost certain that they will start with a loss here with the Olympic champion. They're going to feel under pressure. Brilliant. Just in the. Uh, Quarterfinal and uh, semi-final stage. Nobody knew that, of course. 